What's up guys? We are going into the fourth stage of the Final Fantasy VII Vision World. Um, this one seemed like it needed a little special attention just because it's uh, Magic Week only. So we're going for a budget run. It's a Demon Week 2 uh, Light, does some physical attacks and status ailments. So we're going for a turn 2 clear. All it does on turn 1 is a single target physical. Uh, without accuracy and uh, some status ailments for the party. So, <clears throat> so we've got uh, NVA Tifa as a chain bot, NVA uh, Cloud as a chain bot, um, naked, yeah, Tifa's naked too. Onion Knight, we do have uh, Lightbreaker on him um, in his own TMR. Does he even need that? No. So we are making sure everyone's... I'm not sure if sleep matters, but sleep, petrify, and paralyze immune and confusion immune. So they are naturally resistant. Poison doesn't matter. Um, uh, Red 13, he's our passive provoke evader. He's got conscious uh, TMR on for stat buffs. And he's good because he has a uh, chaining skill that applies uh, demon killer. Uh, Zahn just here to steal the Demon Killer and spread the buffs. Um, pretty much naked, his own uh, TMR or STMR, so he can triple cast and status immunity. Um, yeah, I've got I Love Chocobos on Red 13 for status immunity. And Aerith, just here for a light imbue. That's pretty much it. And then she'll try to cap Holy. Uh, doesn't do it. I think it did like 300 million, something like that, capping that. So just tried to build her. I mean, this is literally the one I got yesterday. I just potted her MP and spirit. Um, so yeah, just high spirit, high MP. If you have better gear, use it. But I had to put hairpin of purity on her so she didn't get uh, paralyzed. Uh, silence immunity is important on her too. Silence immunity on Red 13 also, so he can cast uh, the relieving song. So chain cap materia. Um, yeah, here's her gear. Got uh, Olivera's card on her. If you have the dazzling demoness, uh, I'd put it on uh, Onion Knight because he is capping uh, Meteor, the upgraded Meteor. So. Here's his gear. I would prioritize him over Aerith, honestly. I um, think he's doing like 250 million a hit or something like that. So this is his build, chain cap materia and a, a duplicate copy of uh, Olivera's card. And I thought there was something else I was gonna point out about Aerith. Oh yeah, her. Skill Radiant Prayer needs to be upgraded. Um, trying to think if there's anything else I upgraded on her. Uh, the Holy needs to be upgraded. So, some door pots. Holy upgraded. Uh, Radiant Prayer upgraded. And then Onion Knight. Haven't potted his, door potted his MP or magic either. So, if you want to do that, that would help. But his own TMR helps, or is that his STMR? I forget, TMR. So anyway, we'll get into it. <clears throat> so Onion Knight in the base form is going to do Lightbreaker. Um, Golbez would be an option too. He has a Light and Peril in his kit. <clears throat> you wouldn't get as good a break, so. And you'd have to sacrifice a uh, Materia slot if you wanted to put Lightbreaker on Golbez. So, with Lightbreaker, and then Aerith is going to Radiant Prayer for the Imbue. 
and everyone else is going to triple cast uh, Stardust Ray. Oh wait, yeah, Red 13 is going to triple cast his upgraded Killer Rave for a 150 Demon uh, Demon Killer on himself. That actually lasts more than, yeah, it's five turn duration, okay. And Zahn is going to triple Stardust Ray. So we're just getting the chain count mission out of the way and the number of effective attacks too. There we go. So this turn, uh, Red 13 is going to Relieving Song for a 300% buff. All we have now is 280 from Era. So uh, Zahn can double up. He will critical on Red 13 and spread the buffs. Onion Knight's going to shift and Meteor. Aerith is going to Holy. Tifa will just Stardust Ray three times again. Cloud will triple Stardust Ray. And unfortunately, Red 13's killer buff is only physical attack, so it at least applies to Onion Knight. So we're going to send Aerith, wait a couple seconds, or a second. Send Onion Knight, wait a couple more seconds, and then send the Chainers. So... Okay, it looks like about 1.2 billion, somewhere in there. I think the cap's like between 1.1 and 1.2, so 1.3-ish. So, there we go. Um, let's see. Yeah, so almost a billion with uh, Onion Knight there. So, I mean, with better gearing, you know, that would have gotten more. Um, you could probably push this out to turn three if you wanted to do a reflecting holy strategy. But anyway, I mean, that's overkill. But anyway, so there it is. Uh, hope it helped. Thanks for watching.